So this is a really exciting time at Marquette. The culture around entrepreneurship in general and particularly around social entrepreneurship and social innovation has dramatically changed in the last several years. One of the major resources is our brand new innovation fund. Uh, so the Strategic Innovation Fund allows students, faculty, and staff from across campus to really start to think about how to launch good ideas. And so this fund allows them to start their ideas off and gives them seed funding to start a venture. One of the social ventures is called Public Marquette. So the Public Marquette is a hybrid social enterprise that aims on solving some of the food access issues uh, on the near west side of Milwaukee, which includes Marquette. It came from kind of an idea that was a little, little out of the ordinary um, and really gave it some credibility. It's one thing to approach people with your idea uh, and just a name. It's another to approach them with some backing and uh, some, some validity to your idea and what you're trying to do. So the first year in the Strategic Innovation Fund was a remarkable experience. We had 275 teams put in pre-proposals. Uh, for a brand new endeavor. Final proposals, we had 180, so one of the really um, first measures of success in that was the, the great participation from the campus community. Our proposal for the Strategic Innovation Fund was um, awarded in order to foster sustainability of the Marquette Visualization Lab. So the Marquette Visualization Lab is a large-scale, immersive uh, virtual environment, so picture a giant rectangular room and we project on four out of the six walls using an array of projectors. At the time the fund was introduced, uh, personally we were at a point in the lab where we really needed uh, something like this, some sort of seed funding to advance the projects that we had been uh, garnering some content uh, to date with you know, the, the startup funds of the lab. Uh, given that those funds were running out, uh, the timing was perfect for us, and also the cross-campus sort of interdisciplinary nature uh, of the fund was perfect for us as well. We were already working with 25 different people from across campus, so it was a nice natural extension for us to uh, sort of solidify some of these roles and then build them out moving further. Um, for a number of years now, uh, I've wanted to get iPads for the Hartman Center. Uh, so the funds enabled me to purchase you know, the technology that we needed to get this off the ground. So seed money, startup funds to do something that is innovative in the Hartman Center, really bringing the Hartman Center into the 21st century, developing digital literacy along with the traditional literacies of reading and writing. But as a member of the Innovation Council, I've been impressed by the way they are really encouraging collaboration across the university and with community partners as well. There are a lot, a lot of ideas that may get overlooked because they're not traditional in a lot of ways. And I think Marquette aims to highlight those to show that you can do things differently in order to make things better, in order to um, really hit upon an issue that you think needs to be addressed. Marquette University is a Catholic and Jesuit university, was founded to um, educate students to be the difference in the world. And that really permeates everything we do with our students. Thinking about not just educating them to be successful in their careers, but to be successful as people who make an impact on the world. Social innovation is a great example of how we can be working creatively to find sustainable solutions to big problems, to be working in close partnership with the community, and really is a central piece of how we see Marquette University and its students, its faculty, its staff being the difference in the world.